Hello friends, it's me Doom, and I know that I said that I would be doing Silver Carp and Big Head Carp next, however, it's event time baby, which means it's time for an event video. Now, the first mission for the event is going to take you to Emerald Lake, New York. You're going to head over for $3,000, which I don't have to spare. So what you're going to do is you're going to enter in, and the first thing on the thing is find the George Washington statue here. There is a cannon here, there's a flag here. Hit this flag to get a free gift, and we'll talk about the cannon here in a bit. So, you're going to require a boat. You can either rent one, or rent a kayak, it doesn't matter. I just happened to buy a boat in that last big stream that I did. So, I'm going to use it. There we go. And what you're going to do is you're just going to head straight out. Just going to curve a little bit to make the entry a little bit more easy. I'm going to ease down. You're going to go into this little dock right here. Yep, that's the one. And then here you'll find the George Washington statue. The George Washington statue you'll activate by pressing E on your keyboard or Y on your uh, Xbox controller or X on your PlayStation controller. And yes, it will give you a cannonball and a list of missions. Now let's take a look at those missions, shall we? Alright, so the main mission, the Independence Treasure Hunt. Restore Washington's Blade. Restore the statue of George Washington, get the treasure map, find the Independence Treasure, which is a brand new rod, which I don't know the specs for. Uh, let's see, the first step is uh, find six shards of Washington's battle sword, and for that, you're going to need to do these six quests. You're going to have to catch historic northern pike using the uh, the special lures provided for this event, which you actually have to purchase or find. And I'm going to show you how to find them here in a bit. However, historic northern pike here, historic walleye here. Um, let's see. Number two takes place in Lone Star Mudwater Naharan. Uh, the historic spotted bass, white crappie, black crappie. From the Rocky and Falcon. Historic Cutthroat Trout, Historic Colorado, and Historic Brown Trout from the Naharan, Quan Chin, Everglades, and St. Croix, Historic Smallmouth Bass, Historic Butterfly Peacock Bass, Historic Largemouth Bass, and Historic White Bass. From the Mudwater, Quan Chin, St. Croix, and Sanguanquin, and Kanik Creek as well, need to connect you need to catch Historic Grass Pickerel, Historic Chain Pickerel, Historic Musky, Historic Steelhead Trout, and Historic uh, Chinook Salmon. And finally, from the Falcon Everglades, Sangonquin, uh, Kanik Creek, bleh, can't speak right now. This is my third take on this because I'm using a new recorder. Um, historic Rainbow Trout, Historic Common Snook, Historic Striped Bass, Historic Bull Trout, now these are all with, not all of them are with different lures, however, there are some, you know, some fish that require the same lure, however, yeah, you're going to need them all in order to catch them all. But before we find out how to find those things, let's take a look at this little bonus side mission. Fire Holiday Salutes from the Liberty Cannons, and you get the Fireball Reel, or the Fire Cannon Reel, that's the one. Um, and with that, uh, you will have a rod and reel once you get the main quest line finished. So let's us uh, check out what, how to get those lures for free before you go paying money, because they are available in the shop uh, for gold bait coins. Quite a few of them. You're going to go ahead and spawn back at the start. 
And you're gonna go over to this cannon. Like I said, you get a cannonball when you activate the George statue. You fire the cannonball. It gives you a free gift, either one of the lures, fireworks, or absolutely nothing. You can activate this for another free gift. There is one, at least one of each of these in every map that's included in the map list for this event. Now, when you fire the cannon, everyone who currently has a hook in the water will get a historic attached to it. So, that's nice. However, you can catch them randomly without that as well. Now, another way to do this is the cannon can also give, and the, so can the, uh, the flag, can also give fireworks. You can set off the fireworks, and that happens as well. Uh, I hope you found this entertaining and insightful, and uh, good luck for ev to everybody, and I will see you on the next episode of On Doom Gaming!